Happy November! It is the day one of NaNoWriMo. During the month of November, I am going to be doing a vlog every day for NaNoWriMo, updating you on my word count and my writing process and everything like that NaNoWriMo related and writing related for the month. It is already the middle of the day and I haven't gotten any words in quite yet. That's only just because last night I did a Halloween night readathon where I read all through the night in darkness. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it in the cards up here somewhere. Um, so you can go check that out. It was a really interesting experience. But it did cost me on a lot of the day because I basically spent the entire morning slash early afternoon sleeping. So I just woke up, showered, I'm gonna try to get some words in, and then later on today I'm actually going to be doing a writing sprint on the Plotter Life Facebook group. Natalie and uh, Brittany Wang is going to be posting that, so I'm going to uh, go do that later on tonight and hopefully that will get me some more words in too. But uh, yeah, so that's going to be the start of my day one right now, and let's see how the rest of the day goes. It's only day two, and I'm already sucking so hard on this everyday vlog thing, so I apologize. But this morning, I did um, a sprint in the Plotter Life Facebook group with Natalie and uh, Brittany, and that got me, I think, about like 500 words or so. Now I just got to Starbucks, and I'm going to write some more. Uh, yesterday, I finished the day with just over 1,200 words. So it wasn't quite where my daily word count goal was. Um, I, my daily word count goal is 2,000 words. So I definitely didn't get that on the first day and I'm probably not gonna get it here on the second day either. But I am still very happy about that because it is words written, one. And two is that I am just getting into writing again mm -hmm. after taking like two months off for editing book one of Karma's Children. And I'm just getting into the rhythm of writing again for book two of Karma's Children. Um, so I'm still pretty happy with my progress. I'm actually kind of surprised I ended up writing that much yesterday. But yeah, so I'm going to be going into Starbucks now and doing some more writing, but that's my update for day two. And let's see how the rest of the night goes. Day three of NaNoWriMo. Again, I am sucking at this everyday vlog stuff. It is already like the evening time, but uh... So far today, I have just about a thousand words. I have to check that to make sure, but it's around a thousand words. Yesterday, I finished with about 1,100 words. Still pretty far behind on my daily word count goal, but like I said earlier, there's, um, it's my first few days back at writing from being in editing mode, so I'm pretty happy with what I have so far. Um, and I'm going at a pretty steady pace, which is nice. Anyway, I hosted a writing sprint for the first time today and that was really cool. I hosted it on Instagram, but um, it kind of sucks because <laughs> um, right towards the end of like my, like my time, the timer was about to go off, like 20 seconds before the timer goes off, Instagram just cuts me off and goes, you're playing copyrighted music so you can't like do your live anymore and I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, you didn't even give me, like, a warning, like, earlier. Like, how was I supposed to know that you just, like, cut me off? So, ugh. <laughs> Little upset with Instagram right now, but... Um, it's okay. <laughs> I learned from it. Now I know I can't play music while I'm doing a live, um, writing sprint on Instagram. But, uh, the writers that did join still found it very helpful. As I said, we got through almost the whole 20 minutes of the writing sprint, so it was okay. They still got a lot of words in. We came together as, as a community of writers, and we um, just wrote words for NaNoWriMo, and it was great, and um, I got words in, they got words in, so it was still a great experience, and it just kind of sucks that Instagram cut me off. <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to take a small break 
mainly I just need to get out of the house and like blow off some steam because <laughs> even though like the you know the live word sprints like people still got a lot out of it and I got stuff out of it I'm still pretty upset with Instagram for just cutting me off like that without any warning so I, I need to go um, blow off some steam. <laughs> so I'm gonna go check out this Day of the Dead event that downtown Round Rock, which is the small city that I live in, is doing um, downtown. They're like shutting off the streets and stuff and they're going to have a Day of the Dead celebration. I don't really know um, what kind of stuff they're going to have. I just like saw the email this morning. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna go check that out. Uh, maybe I'll take you along with me and show you a little bit of that. Um, while I take my writing break and my Instagram break. <laughs> that had mangonadas and then they were out so I had to get coco de fruta which is still very delicious. All right everyone, day four of NaNoWriMo. I haven't gotten any words in quite yet today. I've actually just got to Starbucks and I'm gonna do a little bit of reading um, and then later on I'm going to probably go home and do get some words in for NaNoWriMo. Um, but last night I finished with about a thousand words. I don't remember the exact number. Bringing my total up to about 3,400, I believe. So still very far behind on my 2,000 um, a word, 2,000 words a day goal. But I'm still pretty happy. I'm getting a lot of words and we'll see how the rest of the day goes, how the rest of the week goes. Tomorrow I'm super excited because I'm going to be hosting a sprint and the Plotter Life Facebook group. So I'm gonna get a whole lot of words in there with a bunch of other great writers, so I'm really excited about that. Um, today I'm mainly just kind of resting a little bit since it is Sunday. So as I said, I'm just gonna do some reading and maybe later I'll go home and get some words in. All right, everyone, we are on day five of NaNoWriMo, which means that we are almost done with the first week. Can't believe it's going by this fast. So far, I have just about 3,500 words total. I know I'm extremely far behind, but I'm hoping to catch up in these next few days since I'm still kind of getting into that writing headspace. So once again, after being in editing mode for so long, I'm about to film a video for my channel, and then I'm going to be, um, doing a, a live sprint later on in the Plotter Life Facebook group that I'm actually hosting. So I'm super excited about that. It will be um, my first official <laughs> um, sprint, unlike the other day when Instagram cut me off. <laughs> but I'm still, as you can see, I'm still pretty salty about that. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to be doing a sprint later on today and to get some words in and hopefully I can catch up on my word count for the rest of the week today to Marvel and Wednesday. Alright, so we're at the end of day five of NaNoWriMo, and today I finished the day with just over 1,700 words, I believe, and bringing my total to 5,100 words. Um, so that means that I broke the 5K mark, and I am super excited about that. I actually already rewarded myself with um, a soda for my breaking 5K. I don't drink soda very much, and lately it's been my guilty pleasure. Although it kind of sucks because I wanted root beer, and CVS was out of root beer, and then my second choice was Dr. Pepper, and CVS was out of Dr. Pepper. And then my third choice was Sprite, so I got Sprite. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to talk a little bit about where I'm at in my storyline so far. So as you know, I'm writing book two of my trilogy, and it was really great when I first started writing it because it, I was just able to immediately um, jump right into the action, which is really cool. I didn't have to 
worry about setting up things so much as I did in the first book and I'm really enjoying writing it like this. It's just like immediately just dives right into the action and I love it. So, so far I have the first three chapters written and a little bit of the fourth chapter, although technically the third chapter that I just mentioned is um, an interlude. So labeled on my computer or on the document, it's chapter one, chapter two, interlude, and then chapter three. Um, and the interlude just kind of uh, makes it very obvious that it's going back in time and covering something that's like already happened. I haven't come across any major um, plotting issues quite yet. I mean, as I said, I am a plotter. So I did outline all of this beforehand, and I haven't really come across any kind of like plot holes that I need to fix quite yet. Um, I do find myself definitely switching back and forth between uh, book two and book one and making sure that any references that I make to something in book one that I have um, correct and that I remember correctly. But yeah, so, so far, so good. <laughs> I definitely am still pretty far, far behind on my word count goals, but uh, this was, today was definitely a really great day. I got almost 2k. Um, I hosted that writing sprint in the Flutter Life Facebook group. We did three sprints. We did two 20 minute sprints and one 15 minute sprint. Um, oh no, wait, we did four sprints. We did, did we? We, yeah, <laughs> we did four sprints. We did um, three 20 minute sprints and one 15 minute sprint. And basically throughout all of that is when I had like 1500 of those 1700 words. And then after we finished, I just needed to write a couple of more scenes here um, to finish that train of thought that I had uh, that the timer so rudely interrupted. <laughs> NaNoWriMo's going pretty good for, for me so far. I am definitely behind my, my word count goal. I'm trying not to stress about it because in the end it really is just about getting those words in and trying to make it as far as you can. Um, and that's what I think that I'm doing right now. So I'm happy and I'm definitely going to keep working hard on it. And uh, let's see what tomorrow brings for NaNoWriMo Day 6. Welcome to day six of NaNoWriMo. I'm about to head to a Starbucks to get some words in. Like I said last night, I finished the day with just over 5,000 words. So, woo, 5,000 words. I'm so excited. And this, today, I really want to try to actually get my daily word count goal of 2,000 words. I haven't done that yet. The most that I've done in a day so far is just under 1,800. So, I'm gonna make it my goal today to try to write 2,000 words, so let's see how this goes. Alright, so I've got some bad news. Today was not a good day. I set out with a goal of doing 2,000 words today, and then I ended up writing less than 100. And that was because at first I was, you know, sitting there and I was just staring at the screen and nothing was coming out and I sat there for hours and then I realized you know every writer always says like if you're having writer's block you just gotta try to get it out to get those words out even if it's bad and so that's what I did and I ended up writing like 800 words and then I read over those 800 words and I was like that's so bad and I scrapped the whole scene and it's because I'm working on this particular scene between Krista and Kevin and I just it, it just wasn't going in the direction that I really wanted it to go and um, so so I scrapped the scene and um, I do really want to work on that particular scene again I don't want to just like scrap the scene entire in its entirety I just need to approach it in a different way and I have to figure out what that different way is. Um, so I'm going to sleep on it. Hopefully tomorrow will be a new day and I will be able to get that particular scene written in a way that I like. So we'll see. <laughs> Wish me luck. All right, it is day seven of NaNoWriMo. 
After the unfortunate events of yesterday and the not getting very many words in, um, I was able to write about 800 words this morning. Well, not this, like this afternoon, early afternoon. I took part in a um, writing sprint in the Plotter Life group and I was able to get that scene in the way that I really wanted it to. So yesterday when I was working on it, it was I was working on a, a certain scene where I really wanted a specific interaction between Krista and Kevin. And the way that I was writing it, like, embodied the interaction, but not in the way that I wanted. And um, it just wasn't um, leading the way that I wanted it to. And so I thought about it more overnight and um, went back at it today and I was able to write it and I really like the interaction scene and definitely very very glad that I um, scrapped that whole scene yesterday because I definitely needed to just revamp it completely and I'm so glad that I did. Um, so anyway this morning or well, this afternoon I hit 6,000 words and I just got to Starbucks and I'm going to try to write another thousand words to catch up a little bit um, and see if I can get to 7,000 words by the end of the day. Um, so I'll update you at the end of the day. It is day seven, so that means it is almost the end of the first week of NaNoWriMo and it's just so exciting how, uh, how much I've already gotten done. All right, so I'm back home from Starbucks and I wasn't able to get the extra 1,000 words that I wanted, but I was able to get very close to that. I got about 800 words for a grand total of just over 1,600 words for the day, bringing my total for the whole first week of NaNoWriMo about 6,700 words, which I am super excited about. Um, this is the first week of NaNoWriMo, so I am still obviously getting back into the swing of things for writing and it's not in editing mode anymore. Um, and I'm definitely slowly increasing my daily word count. So when I first started off, my word counts were kind of hovering around a thousand and now I'm getting more into like the 1500s and 1600s. So getting up there and so that makes me pretty happy and excited for the future and the rest of NaNoWriMo. Anyway, that is going to be the end of this first week of NaNoWriMo vlogging and hopefully throughout the rest of the month I'll get a little bit better at actually vlogging every day and have a little bit more b-roll footage to spice things up a little bit versus just me talking the whole time. So we'll see how that goes for the rest of the month. I'm definitely getting a little bit more used to it. but. Not quite there yet, <laughs> so let's see how the rest of the month goes. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I try to post new videos twice a week. Uh, during the month of November, I'm going to be posting a weekly vlog for NaNoWriMo, as well as probably posting my more bookish content, like book reviews and author interviews throughout the month as well. So make sure you subscribe and help support my channel. I would really appreciate it. And be sure to follow me on Instagram for more on my TBR list, my own writing, and see some cool, aesthetically pleasing bookstagram photos. Then go find me on Goodreads so we connect more on our mutual level books. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!